Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, my name is Sharon. Today I'm gonna to take you with me to Big Lots and then after we get back home, I'm gonna share a little Christmas decor in my dining room. All right, let's go. Hey guys, so we're back at home from Big Lots and now I'm going to add just a little Christmas decor to my dining room. As I've said in previous videos, this year I've been trying my best to pare down all the things throughout my home and I'm going to do the same here in my dining room. So uh, seeing how this holiday is going to be different uh, than any other, I thought what better reason to make sure I do it minimally, but still with a little glam. Hey guys, let's connect on social media on Instagram and Pinterest at Creative Glam One. 
I'm gonna leave additional photos to this video over there. Stop by and check me out. And make sure you follow. I decided this year that I'm not going to use a smaller plate. At least I don't think so. At this moment, I'm not thinking of putting a saucer nor a bowl. I was just going to wrap my snowflake napkin around the snowflake plate. And add a little greenery in the pick. I don't know which one I like better. Which napkin do you like better? Do you like the one wrapped around the plate? Or do you prefer the one that's gathered on the ends? that's gathered in the middle. I don't know which one I like best. What do you think? You guys leave me a comment. Which way should my napkins go? Gathered in the center or wrapped around the plate? I'm going to be using two chargers this year for each place setting and the base charger here came from Pier 1 as well as the uh, mirrored crystal chargers. They also came from Pier 1. I got both of these uh, several years ago and I love them and they pretty much stay on the table all the time. In the snowflake plates I ordered from Crate and Barrel. They're a part of the Hamilton collection. The napkins I got at Hobby Lobby. The napkin rings I got off of Amazon and the picks, all the picks that you'll see here in my dining room either came from Michael's or Hobby Lobby. And all the garland comes from the Pottery Barn. All the White Houses that I'm using in my winter scenes this year came from Hobby Lobby. I have some other White Houses that I mixed into my winter village that were a more of a porcelain type look. Those came from Target. And then I also have some of the original Limax houses that I used in my large winter village that I did. Um, and I'll link that at the end of this video. Yeah, the Christmas trees that you see spread throughout the table, those are a part of my Limax collection. Um, so that's where they came from. The reindeer I got from Home Goods. Um, the runner I also got from Home Goods. And the drinking glasses, you'll notice. The drinking glasses came from the Dollar Tree. And that's it, other than the silverware. And I won't put any of the silverware out because it just seems to collect so much dust. I stopped putting the silverware out. I keep it in its case and uh, we pull it out when we're ready to use it. And the small buffet table back there in the back, I DIY that table. Um, I will link that video as well in case you missed it. Um, I really love the way that it turned out. The lamps on that table came from Home Good. And the La Petite Cuisine uh, vase, that also came from Home Goods. Um, the little white house, the, the little winter village house that you see back there, that came from Hobby Lobby. And the drinking glasses are my Waterford Crystal set that I got when I got married. 
So uh, we usually only use those for New Year's when we're doing a toast. The um, olive branches inside the La Petite vase came from Hobby Lobby. And the mirrors on the walls are something that I've had for quite some time. I don't remember where I've gotten, I got them from. They originally used to be gold. And then the painting over here on the wall, that I got from TJ Maxx. The vase over in the corner I got from Home Goods. And again, the uh, lamb's ears that are on the inside came from Michael's. And on this side of the room is my large buffet. Um, the two pictures in the black frame, those are prints that I purchased online and printed them out myself. The frames that they are in came from Michael's. The lantern that sits in between them came from Home Goods. I have two bottles of Prosecco sitting on a wooden tray that I believe I got from Home Goods. Uh, the little blue pumpkin I got from Pottery Barn. That little blue pumpkin flows throughout my home, but it is always a part of my decor. I know it's fall, but I love it. I love the color. So it's it's always out. So you can do the what it, where in the world is that little blue pumpkin because it's always on display somewhere in my home. Thanks for tuning in guys. I hope you enjoyed my Big Lots shop with me and the Christmas decor in my dining room. If you did, don't forget to subscribe. Leave me a comment because I'd love to hear from you. And I'd also appreciate if you gave me a thumbs up. At the end of this video, you'll see two links. Click one to see more All Things Home by Creative Glam. And with that being said, have a blessed day and I'll see you right back here next time. Bye.